Hi everyone, the video today covers the topic Hanoi history. Now let's discover. Thanong, Dong Do, Dong Quan and Dong King all were the names of old Hanoi, in which Thang Long was the first one. It was named by King Li Tai To in 2010, the first king of the dynasty. Because of this great position and the legend that he saw a dragon flying when he set foot here, therefore he named the imperial city Thang Long. Thang Long means flying dragon. Thang Long was the political, cultural and economic center of the country only a century. Many architectures today originate from that period, such as one pillar regarded in 1049, the temple in Temple Literature in 1070, and the Imperial Academy in 1076, and so on. Tanglong Imperial City experienced feudal system and rules of many kings and fought against China and Mongol who attempted to invade Tanglong, however, it still remained its position. In 1858, France started its first short to invade into China. In November 1873, French forced moved to Hanoi. Although when courts intended to surrender, Hanoi people insisted on withstanding under the leading of some heroes. In 1884, the fourth king of Nguyen dynasty signed a peace treaty to admit the French protectorate over the territory of Vietnam. Therefore, Vietnam became one of French colonial countries and Hanoi was then the capital of the Chinese Federation. Therefore, they built lots of architecture in French style. In 1921, there were about 4,000 Europeans and 100,000 native people there. In World War II, Japan attacked Indochina. Therefore, Vietnam was ruled under both Japanese and French. When Japan surrendered to the Allies, Vietnamese force under the leading of Communist Party of Vietnam, set up by Ho Chi Minh, carried out the revolution successfully and then retook its power in the North Vietnam. Ho Chi Minh read the Declaration of Independence of Vietnam in 1945 in Hanoi. At the end of 1945, France came back to Indochina, and the Chinese War from 1946 to 1954 started in December 1946. Hanoi continued to be controlled by France. The battle at Viet Minh Phu in 1954 brought the victory to Viet Minh force, which made French sign Geneva agreements and withdrawal from Vietnam. In the second part of the Indochinese War from 1955 to 1975, Hanoi and the North Vietnam, led by Ho Chi Minh, started to build a socialist system with centrally planned economy and were supported by some communist nations. After that, Hanoi suffered from bomb brains of American force, who used the most modern planes at that time. In 1975, Vietnam gained its reunification and stopped the period of separation between South and North Vietnam, and Hanoi has continued to serve as the capital of the country since then. Therefore, Vietnam applied centrally planned economy over the country. However, people's lives at that time were very hard. In 1990, Communist Party of Vietnam decided to switch to open economy, apply market economy, but Communist Party still maintained its position of leading. This helped Vietnam develop in 20 years. In 1999, Hanoi was granted the city of peace by UNESCO and it considered the oldest capital among 11 capitals of Southeast Asia. We've introduced the history of Hanoi. Hope that you will have a brief look about it. Thanks for watching.